ran a lot of reverses. Was that plan going into the game, or did you see some things that they were doing defensively that led you to run more reverses? It was kind of their their defensive approach throughout the game. Uh, Coach Cheney saw that, uh, that, they, that they, the safeties weren't coming down, and they were more focused. They were, they were like heavy set in the line, and he seen it open up, and every reverse worked throughout the game, so why not keep running? And we continued to run, and uh, we excelled off of it. What, the, what did you find most problematic about South Carolina's defense? Uh, most pro, most problematic for us. Yes. Uh, they were they were extremely fast and they were in the right spots. They were uh, disciplined. They were in the right spots every single play, and you know it was tough for me to get it going. But um, that, that's part of it. I just had to grind it out, and you know, I tried my best. But uh, I have to be better, and that's, and that's point blank period. Well, we've seen you so much with the one cut and go all year. Saturday, do you feel you're doing too much, right? Make something happen yourself. Definitely, definitely. I was trying to do way too much, and I, I wasn't. I wasn't really trusting it. And you can see it throughout the whole entire game, uh, stopping my feet, uh, and just trying, trying to do way too much, more than I was supposed to. And, you know, Coach pointed it out, Coach Dooley pointed it out, Coach Chino pointed it out, and uh, that's something I'm be working out uh, this uh, this whole week. Did you know without them having to say it? No, yeah, I did. I did, and, and I was very disappointed in the way I played. And I heard my teammates, you know, by the way I play. We excelled in the passing game, but you got to have a solid running game in order to, uh, to excel in this league. And, you know, we, we fought hard, but uh, I didn't fight as hard as I could, and, and I have to be better. Did you think that Torn was trying to do so much? We've seen him make one cut and go throughout yeah. the year. Was, was that an issue Saturday? Well, I told him that my wife, after the game, said, why does Torn get the ball and stop? Which I think that's your question. And I asked, I told Torn, and, and I said, I saw you outrun the entire Alabama secondary, but then you get the ball in the outside zone and you got green grass and you stop and you don't trust your speed. And I think that's what it is. He doesn't trust, you know, his abilities in some ways because he's still sorting through it. Um, so he gets a little jumpy out there. Uh, he ran a little jumpy the other night. and. Uh, sometimes when you play a real good defensive line, they can make you jumpy. So that had to contribute to it. You know, those guys are quick, they're slanting, they're moving, they're on edge. So you didn't have clean reads all the time. So things would flash and then you lose your trust a little bit. And I think that's what happened. And I think that's an experience issue. I do. You know, Torrens a junior, but this is his first season playing. We're going into the uh... South Carolina game, you were on pace for a thousand yard season. You're a little bit below that right now. What would it mean to you to get a thousand yards? It would mean a lot. Uh, I know that, uh, that I've worked towards getting a thousand yards, and I'm going to continue to work towards that. Uh, I know it seems kind of um, out of it right now, but uh, I'm going to work hard to get that thousand. I know the guys up front are going to work uh, work with me to also do the same thing. You want to take the offensive line out for lunch if you uh, get a thousand? Yeah, I am. <laughs> I told him I would. What about dinner? I'll do whatever I can to get that thousand. <laughs>